Hi everyone, I'm Brad with Campbell Window Film. Over the 30 years that we've been in business, we've become somewhat well known for doing some of the more complicated large commercial window film projects in California, and particularly in Southern California. A few of the more notable properties are Century Plaza Towers, Watt Plaza, more recently Water Garden, Union Bank Square, Howard Hughes Center, several buildings for Irvine Company. We even applied window film to the Wiltern Theater and a myriad of hotels, medical facilities, and event centers. Recently, we completed work in City National Plaza in downtown Los Angeles and had a chance to sit down with Michael Brooks, the operations manager of that facility. This is what he had to say. Recently, the City of Los Angeles uh, provided or approved a 26% utility increase over the next five years. So we were looking at multiple projects uh, that would reduce consumption throughout the facility. Window film being um, one of those projects. The low hanging fruit is, is all but gone at, at, at this stage. So we, you know, we've completed lighting retrofits, variable frequency drives on air handlers, on pumps, on our uh, chillers. So those things we've already completed and then with this recent uh, utility increase we started you know branching out and looking at other projects that traditionally we just haven't done over the years. We when we first started researching window film um, we did some tests on two exposures of the facility the east side and the south side we recorded temperatures of over 110 degrees on the inside so the solar load was astronomical and then so what we did was we we communicated with Campbell Window Film we put in some samples of various types of film and then we remeasured uh, temperatures and we saw reductions of from 105 degrees down to 75 degrees. So it was a huge reduction and when we're trying to maintain 72 to 75 degrees, it literally put us right where we wanted to be. Right now we've, um, I believe we finished the installation a few months ago. So we, we got the majority of it done during the summer months and that's, that was our target, that was our goal to see exactly what the, the savings were going to be and right now through September compared to September of last year so the first month of the, the first nine months of this year to the first nine months of the previous year we've saved over 1.6 million um, kilowatt hours which translates to somewhere in the neighborhood of 300,000 dollars. My first impression of the process itself, I was a little concerned because, you know, like I had said before, we, you know, with variable frequency drives and those type of things, they're behind the scenes. So going into this project, I knew we were going to have to be in every tenant space and every office on two exposures. And just coordinating that, it, it was. I thought it was going to be a huge undertaking and quite frankly it turned out to be relatively simple. I reached out to Campbell for a schedule and I know that that was going to be, it was going to evolve because we have so many tenants, so many different personalities involved. Um, so we put together, Campbell put together a, a monthly schedule for me on a floor by floor basis. And quite frankly, I, I thought it was going to change on a daily basis. But for the most part, through four, four and a half months, it um, literally, it, things went relatively smooth. The, the whole process far exceeded my expectations. 